Good afternoon. We're so glad you're here. Then, we did leave vlog, so if you like this video, you'll come back tomorrow. Ah. Wow. Ah. Oh, it's almost the end of Peter's work day. Anything can become a toy. Wow. Um, it's kind of been a day. It's kind of gone by fast, but just a little. We just have a lot to do, and I think it's just. Hold on, I gotta go to the dentist. I'll, I'll be right back. There was a meeting that's been like rescheduled three months in a row that finally happened today. So that's good. Walking to Jewel for a mini grocery haul. We'll see how that works. Let's put the comments down below how many times you think we're gonna end up um, at Jewel this week, considering it should be the last of it. And there's a car in the parking lot that's got Tampa Bay advertisements all over it. Heck yeah. We're not nervous. Definitely not nervous. Okay, we're, we have a lot ahead of us tonight. In the next few days so we're not cooking tonight we have a plan for the rest of our grocery and we're gonna be productive okay we had to focus to eat dinner with the <laughs> two littles um so we are tired <laughs> um teddy was up a lot james woke up super early i didn't even like think of the effect that like daylight savings would have on us like we did not do any preparing for it at all Plus we had a busy weekend. <laughs> We're all just exhausted. Teddy finally went down for a second nap later in the afternoon. Um, Peter had a full work day. James had occupational therapy today. We just kind of been going, going, going. Um, but we talked last night about how we really don't have a like time to chill. And so we're kind of like, we got dinner, easy dinner from Jewel so that we could rally and get stuff done tonight. So I have my hat on because I'm gonna venture to the outdoors um, to go drop my shoes off. Thank you for everyone who commented and reminded me to get um, my boots fixed before we go and a couple of different things printed for taxes. So two big things that like we want just like off of our plate before we go. Oh, oh gosh. These kids uh, on top of having a crazy day with us um, are flip-flopping right now. Yeah. I'm like, Teddy or James? Who? <laughs> James fell asleep in a what called extremely dangerous zone. Yeah. Far too late for a nap, but too early for bed to the point where like, we're just gonna uh, wing it and he might wake up at midnight like, let's go for the day. <laughs> now Teddy's awake, which yeah. is good for his bedtime. Yeah. Um, I'm getting the vlog up a little later. So I'm gonna go work on our bedroom. I'm gonna keep this child alive. Evie. Oh, she's gone now. I just woke up Eve. This narrow hallway with stuff has been like hard for, that's where she likes to nap, like up against that wall. And we keep on like walking and like not realizing like how close we are and then she gets all disheveled and gets up and walks away. I can't wait for things to be back to normal. All of my drawers are empty except for this one. Um, Usually I would just like pack the whole drawer, but with it being a moving company, um, we're taking everything out and putting it in boxes to make it easiest for them. This is my like accessories drawer that I recently just like organized, even though it's still a little disheveled. I'm just trying to think of how I'm gonna do this one. Now that we are a week out from the move, we have set aside the clothes we're gonna wear for the next week that we can wash rewear and then wear like during the road trip and our first week there um we've set aside all those things already and that's why i can like empty out the other drawers and it'd be fine um but this sort of stuff is like stuff i use more which i guess i'll probably just that's what i'll do i'll just set aside a couple of things a few pairs of earrings a necklace um a few headbands and then just pack the rest up this is when it's starting to feel real because you don't have access to the things that you typically would. 
So you have to be smart. There's room on the bed now for you guys to join me. Great, thank you. Mm -hmm. I love that guy. <laughs> Just got it. Resort TV on. Typhoon Lagoon opens up right when we move down. It's a sign. It's a sign that the world is healing. Are <laughs> you playing the piano with your foot? The boys have joined me in the room. Reality right now. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't like. We had a baby and a dog when we moved to Chicago, but it just feels like there's a lot more like adulting responsibility things that were getting set up prior to the move back. Yeah. We need to figure out when the movers are coming. That's what Peter's trying to figure out now. Either Saturday or Sunday. But that makes a big difference. <sighs> All right, friends. Um, it's midnight. We're calling it. We did a lot more than I expect we expected us to. Um, look at, like, the plants are down. Um, the place is clean. Like, we were able to clean up the living room, clean up the kitchen, dishes and everything. But while... Before that, Sarah and I were tag team our bedroom stuff, and then she continued while I was doing those other apartment stuff, and then we finished the last like hour together in the bedroom. So that's like 95% packed. There's two, there's like a small cart we have to go through, and then our TV stand, which is like a lot of our like, important documents, and that's just gonna go into a box, really. So with that, like our bedroom is pretty much good to go. Like dressers, empty. The bed is gonna come with us in the trailer that we're gonna pull on the minivan. And then, uh, let's see, tomorrow's Tuesday. We pretty, Sarah like literally mapped out the rest of the days that we're here. Um, we're busy the entire time. Most of that is packing. I don't think we have anything like particularly fun. That was like this weekend was the big hurrah. Um, but Orlando is calling. It's, it's close, guys. I don't think it's truly hit me yet, but it's close. So good to be home. Good afternoon. We're so happy you're here for daily vlogs. So if you like this video, we hope you'll come back tomorrow. Do not let these blue skies fool you. It is 32 degrees out today. My own personal Kevin McAllister and I are headed to Whole Foods for a couple of things. Christina Grant and company are coming over tonight. We got more packing to do. Alrighty, I am home. And I have my little sous chef helping me. We're gonna make babach tonight. A sous chef is like, I'm the chef and the sous chef is like my assistant. Okay? Ah. <laughs> so we're gonna get the potatoes going first because they take the longest. Basically babach is potatoes, onions, peppers, and sausage. Ew. Ew! It's gonna be delicious. A little last hurrah before the cards are on their way. Mm. Some pie for pie day. I just had the thought about skinny, like packing up our pie. In the chaos of packing, I don't even know where the camera is, which could be a problem. I have an idea. <laughs> but anyways, I'm on my phone, so I'm sorry. Um, tonight's goal is to finish clearing the boys' clothes out. Um, I started a suitcase for what we want that first week in Florida. I started like clothes that we just need the rest of the time we're living here slash like the road trip because it's I have sunglasses on um it's gonna be like super cold here and like get really warm kind of quick so starting to think about those things um and that just reminds me we don't have a place to stay yet for our road trip down we plan on getting as far as like atlanta or macon um a lot of that kind of a determine, is determined by when we're meeting with the property manager on next Tuesday to like do a walkthrough of our new place. Um, that ha kind of has to be official. So, um, yeah, I'll, I'll get on that. This is Owl. Owl. I don't know. You don't know what? Teddy. Okay, it's good. it's dark over here without any lights. We're playing. And the black owl has been in our car since the cruise, and so everyone's very happy that it's back. I thought it was a goner. It is late, but I'm at Mr. Cards picking up some tools because 
That's something Sarah and I were keeping from Mr. and Mrs. Ryan are some tools, but we, the Sicards have been letting us store them in their garage all the, the past two years. But now I'm here to put as much of it as I can into the minivan, and the rest is going to go into Grant's truck for him to drop off later this week for us to put in our own garage down in Florida. Good morning. We're so happy that you're here. Did we sign off last night? I don't think so. Is this a three-parter? Who knows? I just posted that we're gonna post when we can. Um, we're on the south side today. I haven't worn lipstick in a bit. I opened the camera and was like, what? Um, we are on the south side today. Me and the boys are gonna go out to lunch with my aunts and some family to have a little goodbye. We haven't seen everyone in a while. It's kind of like a low part of the year as far as like birthday parties and events goes. So we want to make sure that we saw them before we went. And then we're having a little game night with my cousin Matt. Um, so we just made it an all day event. Um, Peter's gonna work from here. It's, it's very early. Um, so yeah, he's gonna work from Christina's. So in between, we're gonna be at the Sicard's house. So what did we accomplish yesterday, Peter? A little lot. A lot. Feel like not a lot. A lot. Yeah, we like the boys' clothes, mm -hmm. a lot of the boys' toys, mm -hmm. a lot of like garage stuff yeah. that we're taking. Like that was my parents. That when we divvied up everything, like we've just been keeping at Christina's, mm -hmm. which like that that's been like in the back of my mind for so long. I and the car, you cleared out the car. Cleared out the car. Um. Yeah, today is like a less packing productive day which we're kind of like it, it's, it's bittersweet but like we know like today will be good for us and like we'll be nice to see everyone um but yeah that's like there's not as much like productivity for today probably when we get home though yeah oh you got it wow okay he's finally it. followed poppy up the stairs Oh, <gasps> wow. Tickle, 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 tickle. Okay, it's totally the next day. Um, Teddy is teething. So there's that. Get it. He did pop a new tooth, but I think the the bottom right um, came through, but I think the bottom left one is as well. We had a nice night last night at my cousin Matt's. We played games. He ate stuffed pizza, which is different than deep dish. So, we came home. These kids. Are you tickling him? <laughs> um, we came home and we went straight to bed. So, today and tomorrow, I mean really the next four days, we got a lot to do. Um, don't mind the chaos, but that's just reality right now. Happy Thursday, but it's actually Friday for Peter because we decided after looking at what we have to get done in our home, in our neighborhood, in our city, that, and with my work schedule, because I only had like three big-ish meetings tomorrow, but I was able to like move them around to after PTO and before PTO so that I could take tomorrow off. So I am now on PTO until Monday the 27th, in which case, in which, in which, when which, when in which I will be going to the office on that Monday and Tuesday as like a welcome back to Florida. Um, check it out. Couches are moved. We started cleaning up behind them, underneath them, detaching them because they're sectional. Um, this is a crazy vlog and I know you guys will be understanding because it's crazy times. So happy Thursday. 
We are pressed for time, so we are probably gonna order out. I don't know, we need to use up our groceries, but at the same time, we need to prioritize time. So, we got Joy's rice and noodles for dinner. This is mine. It's like crispy fried noodles with Thai curry. Peter got some beefy rice thing. We got free crab rangoon, which was lovely. Some egg rolls. So we actually have never tried this place. We've always wanted to. So a little neighborhood last hurrah. Hey. We finally watched Ted last. For some sanity. Yeah, for a little break between the kids going down and when we start cleaning and packing again. Yeah. So. Episode one, really good. Yeah. Uh, so the whole season right now. Definitely like a good setup. There's like, once again, so like, if, as, I hope it does not as well as season one and season two. Like, there's like so many different stories mm -hmm. going on at the same time. Yeah. And I'm going to start packing and Peter's going to do the routine. The routine. <laughs> when is this vlog ever going to go up? I don't even know. We'll Soon. see. A week of packing. Good morning. We're so happy that you're here. We daily vlogs. If you like this video, come back tomorrow. St. Patrick's Day. We're starting our day with Lucky Charms. Peter is off of work today. His out of office is officially on until yes. 27. 27. So. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Hi. <laughs> the sun is just shining in on us today. Look how cute these little leprechauns are. Oh, stop, stop, stop. We get, we've got Toy Story on. The couch is here. Things are piling up. Our BFF Lauren, um, she's giving us another couch. So that's where Peter is. He went to go pick it up. I got the kitchen cabinets emptied. I got just like little odds and ends done. I'm going to fold some laundry. Um, we have a little bit of paperwork to do. I'll give an update soon on... Jamesy continuing therapy down in Florida once we know a little bit more information, but we're like, that's all getting situated. I really didn't expect to get that much done while Peter was gone, but I'm proud of myself for it, doing it. Oh, Mr. Buckethead. <laughs> that is silly. Guys, this is, this week is <laughs> They're taking a toll on us, especially today. I mean, today was a very productive day. Yeah, and but exhausting. Yeah, and like it's like us, like we're a team of two, getting it all done and yeah. taking care of the two littlies. Yeah. We um, found out today when the moving moving truck is arriving. And yeah. It's coming Sunday, which is yeah. bittersweet. Yeah, because if it came tomorrow. We'd be up all night. <laughs> We'd be up all night, and I have something that I'm doing tomorrow outside of the house, so, like, I would have been, like, a little bit, like, my head in two places. Um, but then, like, it would have been over, and Sunday we could have just had all day, like, clean and prep, but yeah. it's all right. Tomorrow yeah. we can get a lot done again. <laughs> and I was, like, thinking earlier, I was like, when are we going to feel peace? Like I'm going to feel peace when i think i think my biggest thing right now is the moving truck so yeah. i think i'll have feel peace 80 percent to 90 percent of the way when the moving truck leaves with all of our stuff see i feel like i'm going to feel peace when we like walk in the door of our new townhouse like after the hoa registration yeah. and because we, like, we don't even like get to florida and we're like oh we're here it's like we have to get to florida and like do an hoa registration and learn all the rules and then meet our property management company to like do a walkthrough and then right. like then when they leave we can breathe for a minute and then we download the trailer yeah so i just feel like that's when i'll probably feel so like tuesday, we're like so safe tuesday at like 3 30. <laughs> yeah so in four days <laughs> I'm, I'm shooting for like a sunday at like four i have a lot of travel mostly like driving anxiety um and i just want i just want everyone to be happy and it will yeah. be. Yeah. Really so this is, we also decided tonight this can be one big long packing vlog. Super mega vlog. And then, um, and then once we get there, we'll be back to our normal schedule. So, so, so Friday's <laughs> I don't even over. I know what we've been filming so, here. 
but we're if today is the first it. and last shot of the, of the day we're so glad you're yeah. here it's good to be home <laughs> wait one thing though is that even though like we're wrecked i do feel the most prepared we ever have been yeah, in the ever for so like move. i'm trying to like keep that at the forefront so yeah. but it doesn't i feel this <laughs> it's good to be home to just commemorate this day the 18th we did not vlog a single clip we're getting into bed it's 2 15 in the morning but we're so close and the movers are gonna come tomorrow between nine and noon we're gonna get a little bit of sleep and then tomorrow the real fun begins good morning we're so happy you're here we daily vlog so if you like this video come back tomorrow Daisy, you got my shoes on. <laughs> You're a silly guy. They fit great. Where are you going? It's 20 degrees out. The moving truck is here and it's getting filled. Say, wake up! <laughs> All right, movers are officially gone, but now we're off to U-Haul to get a trailer to put our beds in. Okay, we're wrapping up our night. Um, we did not show much today. I swear, like, I wanted to at least do, like, a time lapse of, like, stuff going out. But even though we've done this so many times, it's still, like, we are not pros whatsoever. But my sister Jenna came and helped. Um, and she had fun with the boys and Eve and all that. And then my sister Christina and her family came and helped. So we're wrapping up. We were hoping to be in bed by midnight. It's 12.30. We're going to bed now. Did we accomplish everything? No. But did we get 95% over there? Yes. So, um, we have like a plan. Mm -hmm. We still have to do a, a few minor things. The thing is tomorrow is a long drive. We're going like past Atlanta. So, um, we want to get on the road as early as possible. We also want to be as safe as possible. Mm -hmm. um, but I feel really good and I don't feel like physically exhausted, I feel like I'm tired. Yeah, no, I Because we physically. haven't been having good sleep, but. That's what makes me feel good about time being a long drive with us going to bed now, getting up in like five hours. Yeah. Wow. We did it again. We Jeez. did it again. Can we like not move across the country <laughs> yeah. for the next, I don't know. 10 years? I mean, yeah, we'll see. You never know what we'll have up our sleeves. Are you ready to move to Disney World again? Still doesn't hit me. But I know. Yes. <sighs> wow. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.